my name is Iga and you're watching Pixie in the Notes. Oh, and I have my faithful little assistant, <laughs> Sushi. <laughs> she likes to help mommy, right? And we are smelling nice. Or not so nice. Okay. <laughs> to the point. Today I would like to talk about a um, fragrance that I tested a few days ago and that is Parfums de Marly Calan. I was really really curious to smell this one because it's very often compared to Baccarat Rouge 540 and whenever I hear this comparison I'm always like let's see and <laughs> with this one I can definitely see where people are going at with this comparison uh, but <laughs> right off the bat I would say this is like Baccarat gone wrong okay so it's a weirdo for me Kalan is a weirdo because it does indeed have that cotton candy vibe but the weird thing is that this cotton candy is not sweet it's like cotton candy made of something salty it lacks the the sugar sugary sweetness for some people it might be like a good thing if they don't like to smell like like sugar and it also doesn't have that um, it doesn't have that Um, burnt sugar quality it's actually it's not sweet at all um, so um, looking at the notes we have spices red orange black pepper lavender um, orange blossom oak moss tonka bean and sandalwood and amber and I I can see that mossy quality it's very it's very mineral and in that way it also kind of reminds me of uh, Ganymede from Marc Antoine Bourgeois. It's like a mix between Baccarat and uh, Ganymede but it's really inferior to both of them. So <laughs> if I was to go for something mineral and cosmic and leathery I would go for for Ganymede and um, if I wanted to smell like cotton candy, like a sophisticated cotton candy, I would go for Baccarat. This one I can see um, that people who are not into very sweet stuff could enjoy, but if you are looking for something along Baccarat line uh, and vibe, yeah this is like <laughs> Baccarat gone wrong. A salty cotton candy it's a weirdo so I'm not I'm not thrilled I don't hate it but uh, I expected something completely different so mm, I don't know yet uh, what to think about it is it good is it bad I don't know I definitely don't feel compelled to wear it if I want a similar vibe I I'll just buy, uh, wear Baccarat and I found another fragrance that has a Baccarat um, vibe but smells much much better and I'll, I think I'll mention it uh, in another video. So that's it for today. I hope you enjoyed my ramble. Let me know if you, uh, if you like it, what you think, if you agree with me or not. Um, thanks for watching and see you next time.